Just as my colleague Han Bin reports on the other side of the Khunjra Pass, border security is boosting trade and stability. Pakistan continues to promote opening up along its borders with China, believing a long-term cooperation strategy goes beyond a trade initiative. These trade links are already transforming border towns, just like Sost, and benefiting the people living here. According to the South Asia Terrorism Portal, over 62,000 people have been killed in Pakistan since 2003 in the so-called war against terror. And until recently, some restive areas presented Pakistan as one of the most dangerous countries in the world. The northwestern tribal areas were plagued by the Taliban, and terrorism had even reached Pakistan's largest city, Karachi. But in the last five years, the number of such incidents have significantly fallen, owing mainly to several military operations. And with the arrival of the multi-billion dollar China-Pakistan economic corridor, security has further improved. Only recently, an international cricket match was held at Miran Shah in the Pak Afan border tribal agency of North Waziristan as a testament that the most hostile of areas in the country have been cleared of militants. The trajectory on which Pakistan is now moving, I am sure the CPEC coming up, uh, we are moving towards our destiny of peace and prosperity. And as regards security of CPEC, Pakistan security forces have taken on this responsibility and given by the government. And we shall do it uh, to the best of our abilities. Observers say violence has dropped by three quarters in the last two years. And now Pakistan is safer, 16 years after the U.S. launched its war on terror. To address security concerns, the Pakistan Army has raised a 15,000 men strong special security division, which consists of nine army battalions and six civil security wings uh, to look after the security of CPAC related uh, projects all across Pakistan. The Suki Kanari hydropower plant in the northwest is part of the corridor's early harvest projects by China's Gizuba Group. The Chinese workforce numbers in the hundreds. I will say only one thing. Security is absolutely no problem for us because we believe that we have good protection from the Pakistan Army. At Khunjra Pass on the border with China, trade activity has already begun. Though the Pakistan Army is providing complete security at the Khunjra Pass at Pak China border, but the special force of the Gilgit Baltistan police is providing special security to transporters carrying goods to and from China at uh, the uh, Karakoram Highway. CPEC being the uh, critically important project and uh, uh, very game, a game changer project for the uh, prosperity of the Pakistan is a very important uh, law enforcement agencies, Gilgit Baltistan police and the government is very much vigilant to thwart their, uh, their nefarious intentions. And so far they have succeeded. During the times of militancy, the tourism industry was affected, but now tourists have returned to the region. And Pakistan has already started fencing its 2,600-kilometer border with Afghanistan in an effort to stop infiltration of terrorists. Before the border management policy was put in place, there was a free movement at the Torkham border of at least 40 to 45,000 people. But after the National Action Plan has been implemented, the movement has been restricted significantly. A measure experts believe was long in coming that will further secure the China-Pakistan economic corridor in the years to come. Daniel Khan, CGT and Khunjra Pass, Park China Board.